glass is actually against the frame here. And it's inside of the framework here. Got a big gap over here. Big gap. Hmm. The difference on up and down. can see these are bent that way. They need bent back. But that framework, that's got to be, that's got to move over. Three-eighths of an inch will give me clearance. That much would be good. It would be equal on both sides then. And this part appears on a on a stud, so it, it will pivot as I pull the back over. I'm still thinking I gotta bend these bars here, make them kick kick the top over. I am 22 and a quarter. Okay. And I'm 22 inches here on this one. All right, after all of the measuring, this is what I've got. Here's the Here's the frame. Here's the front of the um, windscreen, windshield. And this is the part that the vinyl would fold over and anchor to. The frame from driver's front to the passenger back corner, 42 and 7 eighths. From the front to the back, it's 43 and 5 eighths. So this frame is not square. There's three quarters of an inch. It needs to be bent somehow. Those arms coming up to bring this back over three eighths of an inch. From the back to the front is a quarter of an inch difference from this side to this side. This one is longer.
already got these off. So this one is uh, just not pushing anything. It just seems to be hanging right there. So this needs to be tweaked here so that it pushes. over that frame wants to come this way so over there I have this one wants to push that way and this one's just hanging there but it actually needs some too so okay so if I take this and tweak it that'll pull this this way and this one can be bent a little tighter kinked a little bit more there to bend it this way I gotta have this coming over it's just not wanting to do it on its own that's telling me that let's see I don't know Something here is wanting to make this push that way, so let's see. Three quarters of an inch gap at the bottom of the leg here. I'm going to roll the windows down and see if the uh, up here will pivot now. The um, stud or the rivet up here, it squeezes the rivet pretty tight. Pretty tight. Okay, this is touching here. And we're about that other side. Plenty of gap here. Okay. I've got half an inch gap here between the glass and the metal frame. I've got about a quarter of an inch here, so I may have bent it a little bit too much. Okay, quarter of an inch touching here, touching there. Bushings here do have some slop in them. Okay, that one is just a little bit too much. I need to tweak it back.
help push it back away from the window glass. Okay, there's a about three eighths, and same over here. This is good. Might need just a little bit of a. so that it touches. Okay. I'll put the screws back in, the bolts back in and see how it fits. Okay, and it's fairly straight. This one I got just a little more. It's, uh, it's close there, but it's not touching. Okay. This is bent a little tighter. Might be able to straighten that out a little bit. But this is a little bit higher than the back, so it's got just a little bit of a crown to it. not such a big gap now. There's nothing behind that to hold that side out. This snap needs to be up here because that's where it's pulling from, from right here. It needs to be in line so this is just funky. I don't care for that. That has moved over. All right, it's better than it was.